morning, everybody. My name is Corinne Dial, and I'm a 10th grade student at Don Bosco Crystal Way, and I'm here interviewing Mr. Miles, 9th grade freshman teacher at Don Bosco Crystal Way. Hello. About the upcoming election and the earlier memories for voting. So, Mr. Miles, can you talk to me about the first time you voted? First time I voted. Um, my first real integration into politics when I was able to vote was 2004. Um, it was the presidential election between President Bush, uh, who was the incumbent at that time, and the Democratic nominee, nominee of um, Kerry, Senator Kerry. And um, I was living at Marquette. I was a freshman that year, so it was kind of jazzed up. Uh, it was my first time that I was really able to kind of put my vote forward and in some sense make my, my voice heard, uh, be an individual. And it was fun. Um, our campus was a little uh, politically divided, but um, had some great friends. And I grew up in a fairly moderate to conservative household and uh, ended up voting for President Bush that year and a whole bunch of other things. Because obviously in a presidential election, there's a lot more going on than just the presidents. There's senates, there's house seats, and there's uh, a lot of local municipalities have uh, mayors, sometimes treasury secretaries, and Sometimes just local representatives it could be just from your town. So there's a lot of stake and there's a there's a lot of things to look into. So, uh, like, what were your primary reasons for going for the president? My primary reasons today or past? In the past, when you first voted. Uh, my primary reasons for voting for a president. Well, I think it's a duty. Um, you have a responsibility in some sense if you live in this country that you should um, participate in it. Don't, uh, no matter what your political views are or whatever you stand for, if you don't go out and take that time to cast a ballot and uh, make your voice heard in some sense, then in my opinion, you don't really have much of a right to complain um, about certain situations. So. And uh, have, have your views from 2004 changed on how you would vote in 2008? Oh, absolutely. Four years makes a big difference. So you've got more experience, more sometimes wisdom. <laughs> um, but yeah, my, my views have changed. I live in a different area now. Um, you know, the people around you kind of affect who you are because uh, your identity is built off of relationships. And uh, I'll be, I've already casted my absentee ballot, but uh, I certainly am going to make sure that I'm heard. So. There you have it, folks, straight from the ninth grade teacher himself. And uh, we'll see you next week.